Air of dogma, it'll trap your mind. Religious dogma, it'll make you blind. Beware of dogma, it's not designed to let you think for yourself. If we let it out in the universe, there will be no doubt. Everything is worse. Beware of dogma. Don't let it loose. That unchained dogma, it'll reproduce. Tie up your dogma. There's no excuse for ignorance anymore. Beware of dogma, don't let it loose, that unchained dogma, it'll reproduce, tie up your dogma, there's no excuse for ignorance anymore. Please, clean up after your dogma. <laughs> So I got to write a song with the famous Broadway composer Charles Strauss. I sent him some lyrics, he edited them down, and we came up with a song called Poor Little Me. The multitudes mumble mythologies without end. But me, I have trouble with ologies that pretend to know what can't be known, to show what can't be shown. Lutherans have liturgies, Calvinists have creeds, Muslims have their minarets, Catholics have their beads, Methodists have methods, holy truth to ascertain, but poor little me, I only have a brain. <laughs> Bishops transubstantiate, Shintos ring their bells, Transcendentalists meditate, while Wiccans weave their spells. Hindus chant a mantra when they can't relieve the pain. But poor little me, I only have a brain. So fearful of the Netherland, believers band together. Unhappy with the weatherman, the Zunis wave a feather. They dance in circles to demand great spirit, send some rain. But what do you do if you only have a brain? Quakers quake and shakers shake and Jews eat kosher food. Rastafarians wear their hair in pious gratitude. They all boast of miracles that no one can explain. But poor little me, I only have a brain.
So fearful of the Netherlands, believers band together. Unhappy with the weatherman, the Zunis, those are Indians, you know, the American Indians, Zunis, the Zunis wave a feather. They dance in circles to demand great spirits and some rain. But what do you do if you only have a brain? Quakers quake, and shakers shake, and Jews eat kosher food. Rastafarians wear their hair in pious gratitude. They all boast of miracles that no one can explain. But poor little me, poor little me, I only have a brain. Do I have time for one more song, maybe? <laughs> okay, I was reading uh, Richard Dawkins' book, Unweaving the Rainbow, a beautiful, excellent book. I'm sure you have all read it. And in there, he makes a plea for more art and science. So I thought, why not write a love song, a human love song, that just simply assumes the truth of evolution? Thanks to Galileo for showing us our humble place in outer space. And thanks to Mr. Darwin for showing us the origin of the human race. Which means that our precious romance is mainly the product of chance. And these feelings of love so frenetic are just genetic. It's only natural that I would want you. It's only natural that you want me. A million years of evolution had its way. So we can blame it on our parents' DNA. I move instinctively in your direction. Somehow you signal me to turn and see. You will always be my natural selection. As a voluntary choice, naturally. Natural that I would want you. It's only natural that you want me. A million years of evolution had its way. So we can blame it on our parents' DNA. I move instinctively 
in your direction. Somehow you signal me to turn and see. You will always be my natural selection. As a voluntary choice, as a deterministic free will choice, as a voluntary choice, naturally. Beautiful. Dan Barker, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. Brilliant. Amazing. Now, nice.